looking out my back window and I thought to myself, there's got to be more to life. It was like there was a lightning bolt. Like I had this vision of my life as I'm like looking out my back window at the drainage ditch that was my backyard. No, I have this vision of a house with a yard with my kids playing in the backyard laughing while I'm grilling steaks on a grill of food I could not afford at the time. While my wife comes up behind me, gives me a big hug and says, I love what we built. No, I'm choosing myself. I'm going to go all in on myself. I went back to school. I became the top student. I got a job at one of the largest accounting firms in the world, a job that everyone told me I couldn't get. They all, all my professors told me I was too old. So of the big four, I got four offers. And along the way, I'm having to like budget. I'm having to like look at myself in the mirror and pep myself up, you know, and, and work through confidence issues. But it all comes back down to like, I've got this vision. Have you ever gone all in on a vision for yourself? And if you haven't, you're worthy of that vision. As men, that's a big part of what we do is we find this vision and then we lead ourselves and the people around us to a better world. My counter to you though, if I'm a guy that's stuck, how can I imagine something that seems so far away? It doesn't even seem real. Look right where you're at. Do you like where you're at right now? If no, pick one small thing. Shortly after this, I cleaned my car. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I do know that the type of man that is going to get out of this situation has a clean car. This might be not be the nicest car, but this is my car. And the things mm-hmm. that I touch turn to gold. So I'm just going to take care of this car. It's a small mindset shift of like, okay, I maybe don't know where I'm going if things don't seem possible, but a clean car is. So I'm just going to start dedicating myself to excellence in all the small places. 